This is grade three, unit six, lesson 29, day two. You're going to read, spell, and read five new high frequency words and then read the chart. Get ready. This word is meat. What word? Spell meat. Word? Yes, meat. This word is third. What word? Spell third. Word? Yes, third. This word is paragraph. What word? Spell paragraph. Word? Yes, paragraph. This word is months. What word? Spell months. Word? Yes, months. This word is raised. What word? Spell raised. Word? Yes, raised. Word? Meet. Word? Paragraph. Word? Third. Word? Months. Word. Written. Word. Third. Word. Cannot. Word. Believe. Word. Raised. Word. Discovered. Word. Meet. Word. Raised. Word. Square. Word. Paragraph. Word. Months. Now you'll say the sound for some spellings. Get ready. Sound. Aw. Sound. Ooh. Sound. Coo. Sound. Er. When the Y is here, sound. J. When the Y is here, sound. S. Sound. Or. Sound. Aw. Sound. Er sound, I, long sound, E, short sound, E, uh, sound, I, sound, O, sound, E, uh, sound, Er, sound, Ah. Uh. These sounds can make, or these spellings can make other sounds depending on the word that they're in. Let's talk about two prefixes today. Remember, a prefix is a word part that is added to the beginning of a word that changes the word's meaning. These are the two prefixes we're going to discuss today, un and dis. Both of these mean not. So let's talk about if you come to a word that maybe you aren't sure of the meaning or that you don't know how to pronounce the word. I know you know what this word is, but let's practice on this one. First of all, I can recognize that there is a prefix here, and I know that prefix is un, and then I see that base word is real. So I know that un means not. So when you add that to this base word, that means unreal means not real. Here's another word with the second prefix. I can see this prefix dis and I see the base word agree. When I add the meaning not to this base word agree, I know that this word disagree means to not agree. You can add un and dis to your anchor chart of our affixes. Remember, knowing the meanings of our affixes can help us know the meanings of and learn new words. Now let's read some words. Prefix, un, base word, ripe, word, unripe. Prefix, dis. Here's our base word that has an ending. What is this base word? Pleased. What word? Displeased. Prefix, un. Here is our base word with an ending. 
What is that word? Used. Whole word, unused. Prefix, dis. Here's our base word. Order. What word? Disorder. Prefix, dis. Base word, agree. Word, disagree. Root, tele. Base, scope. Word, telescope. Syllable, dis, syllable, gust. Word, disgust. Prefix, un, base, even. Word, uneven. Base word, sign, ending, ing. Word, signing. Root, homo, another root, phone. Whole word, homophone. We adjust for the pronunciation. Syllable, tree, syllable, t. Word, treaty. Syllable, b. Syllable, side. Word, beside. Syllable, whis. This is silent. Syllable, l. Word, whistle. Syllable, strug. Syllable, goal. Syllable, strug. Syllable, goal. Word, struggle. Syllable, flow. Syllable, er. Word, flower. Sound, ah. Word, brought. Now let's read some sentences. Get ready. Read. The paragraph was written beside the picture. Yes, the paragraph was written beside the picture. Read. Flowers growing in warm climates will bloom for months. Yes, flowers growing in warm climates will bloom for months. Now pause the video to get ready to practice your spelling. Now let's practice reading or spelling words. Get ready, word, apple, word, river, word, little, word, October, word, ladder, word, summer, word, purple, word, later, word, November, word, giggle, word, uncle, word, winter, word, center, word, double, word, flower, word, people, word, whistle, word, character. Remember our spelling this week has final syllables that end in ER or LE. The ones that end in LE have that syllable shape of consonant LE that we talked about yesterday. Today, we are going to be spelling words that end in ER. They're two syllable words. The first word is river. What word? Let's break that into syllables. Riv, er. So stretch, r, iv, er. Write the spelling for river. Check it and correct it. What word? Spell river. Word? Yes, river. The next word is October. What word? Let's stretch those syllables. Oc to Burr. So stretch. Oct-o-b-er. Write the spelling for October. Remember, this is a month, so it needs to be capitalized. Closed syllable, open syllable, and a syllable with vowel R. Check it and correct it. What word? Spell October. 
word, October. The next word is ladder. What word? So the syllables are ladder. This has a double consonant here. Lad -d -er. Write the spelling for ladder. Check it and correct it. What word? Spell ladder. Word? Yes, ladder. The next word is summer. What word? Let's stretch those syllables. Summer. Stretch. Sum er. Double consonant here. Write the spelling for summer. Check it and correct it. What word? Spell summer. Word? Yes, summer.